In this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how we can modify a basic label widget inside TakeInter and modify its properties such as text that you can see over here. Then there's also optional parameters, properties like background which changes the background color, foreground which changes the text color, the foreground color. Then there's also font which can change the font size, the font family. And there are plenty of others like highlight background, highlight color, highlight thickness, all kinds of cool parameters like that. Okay, so how do we modify these? How do we set their values? Well, it's actually very easy to do this at initialization. When we're initializing this label, when we're creating this label, we can just define these right here. Okay, like so. And if I run this code now, we get a label of size 14 with a green background. But that's not the problem here. That's not what this video is about. This video is about how we can modify these parameters, these properties, after the label has already been initialized. Okay, for example, after you click a button. So I'll define a button over here that is responsible for changing the properties in our label widget. Okay, so we'll just call the function modify which I'm going to define in a minute. And here we go, def modify. And here I'll do my label. Now every widget inside takeinter has a config function. This config function can be used to modify its properties, okay? Properties, its different attributes like text, okay? We can modify text just like this. And if I change this to new text, and if I run this code, and if I click this button, it's going to change the text. Likewise, if I do this for the background, we can also change the background, okay, to say red. And, oh, whoops, double sign there. Okay, if I click this now, both the text changed and the background color changed. And we can do anything like this. We can also change the font, okay? Change the font to a different font family, like Verdana or something. Hopefully that's available on my system. And it is, yeah, cool. So the font size and the font uh, color, the font text, all of those changed. And this is a really cool way of modifying your widgets, not just the label widget. This works on pretty much any widget, all right? Hopefully you guys found this useful. Subscribe to the channel, leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what you thought, and yeah, hope to see you guys in a later video. Bye then.